everyone, welcome to DIY with Nancy. Today I'm gonna to show you how I make my sweet egg cream filling. You can actually use it for a topping as well. And in Portuguese, I call it dos tofs, or ovos molhos. This is perfect for a cake filling or a cake topping. You can even use it for puff pastry. And I'm gonna show you how to make my sweet egg cream today, dos tofs, and I'm gonna show you how to make it step by step. So stay with me and let's get to baking. The first step in making the dos tofs sweet egg cream in a medium sized saucepan, place three quarter cups of water. And to that, I'm going to add one cup of granulated sugar. Next, I've placed the heat on a low to medium heat. Using a whisk, I'm just going to give it a quick stir to combine the sugar with the water, just as I'm doing here. So just about 10 seconds, you just wanna mix it in well. And at this point, I'm going to add one cinnamon stick. Now I'm just going to wait until the sugar and water comes to a boil and essentially it'll become a syrup. It'll be a clear liquid. Now you can see that the water and sugar have formed a syrup. It's come to a boil. I'm just gonna give it a quick stir. Now I just wanna show you the sugar and water is a liquid, but as it cools down, it will thicken. Now that the sugar and water have formed a syrup, it's really hot, you wanna set it aside and let it come to a lukewarm temperature. The syrups cool down, and now at this point, you can see that it's thickened. So as it cools down, it thickens, and you can see it coats the spatula, and that's how I know the syrup is ready. And now moving on to the next step. For the last and final ingredient, I have six large egg yolks, and I'm just gonna use a whisk to whisk them together before I add the eggs to the syrup. Now, once I've stirred together the eggs, I'm ready to add it to the sugar syrup. Next, I'm adding the eggs to the sugar syrup that is now at a lukewarm temperature. Place all of the egg mixture into the saucepan. I wanna make sure I get everything in there. For the final step, now that I have the eggs in the syrup, I'm just going to stir it to combine before I turn on the heat. And also before I turn on the heat, I'm just gonna remove the cinnamon stick. Now at this point, I've just turned on the stove to a low to medium heat and you wanna continuously stay by the stove to stir the mixture until it thickens. Now I've been continuously stirring for about four or five minutes. You could see that the egg mixture has now thickened. Now I'm just switching over to a spatula so you can see. Now you know your sweet egg cream dostovsh has thickened. You can see it coats the spatula, that's a little test. And you can also run your spatula through the bottom of the saucepan. And if it takes a few seconds to come together, you know it's ready. Now once the dos tofs has thickened, I'm gonna turn off the stove and transfer the sweet egg cream dos tofs to a bowl. Now you can see the sweet egg cream dos tofs is a pouring consistency, but as it cools, it will thicken a little more. Now I want to show you that the sweet egg cream dos tofs does thicken. It's been sitting on my counter for about 15 minutes. And I wanted to show you how the consistency does thicken. You can use the sweet egg cream for a topping or filling of a cake or for any pastry. It's absolutely delicious. Now what's great about making dos tofs or sweet egg cream is you don't have to use it on the same day that you make it. You can actually refrigerate it for up to five to six days. And that's my recipe for my sweet egg cream dos tofs. I'm gonna place this in the refrigerator uh, and you can place it up to five to six days. Uh, generally, I use it within two to three days for making it, but you, it holds well in the refrigerator for up to six days. Um, now, I'll be making future recipes with the sweet egg cream, and I wanted to make it for you today so that way you have the recipe. So, I hope you all enjoyed the sweet egg cream recipe, Dustovsh. 
And if you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. And until next time, everyone, thanks so much for watching. Take care.